Greetings, lightworkers. This is Jack Peterson coming at you from Bali. Let me know in the comments below where you're tuning in from and how you're feeling in this 2022 Lion's Gate that's coming up on August 8th, 2022. Once again, I'm Jack Peterson, and I'm a star seed with a lion heart who's obsessed with spiritual growth, and I'm here to guide souls to their enlightened soul partner and through this massive awakening of consciousness that's happening right now, this great awakening. Today, I'm going to be sharing a bit about this energy updates at this time, specifically the Lion's Gate portal that's going from July 28th through August 12th. Make no mistake, this is a highly charged and powerful spiritual time. Like a pot of boiling water, we're going to be cooking in a good, enlightened way, especially during the peak of this Lion's Gate. So if you dig this video, then please smash that subscribe button and also hit the like button. This time represents the moving of the sun into the ruling sign of Leo and the rising of the star Sirius, known as our spiritual sun. The Egyptians were very in tune with the star Sirius and believed this energy of Sirius carried advanced wisdom. When the star was rising, the Nile River would flood, so it also represented prosperity and fertility. This is a time for the following, great spiritual awakenings, potent downloads from our higher self, possible visitations in dream space, increased creativity to move our higher purpose work forward, past vision surfacing in your memory, great manifestation potential. This is a time to set our greatest vision of what we want to achieve, what we want to manifest into our lives. We also have in astrology, Uranus conjunct Mars happened recently, with which also conjuncted the North Node, and this occurred on August 2nd. So if you notice some really intense, volatile energy recently, that's why. There could be some major unexpected twists and turns lately in your life or in current events that could continue well in it to October. There could be a difficult time to decide where to invest your money, could be a time to reevaluate what you really value, what you really value in life is evolving. Perhaps you're changing your diet or going through changes with your body. Plus, ever since 2012, our planet has entered a highly energetic area in the Milky Way galaxy, which is increasing the vibration here at a rapid pace. What this means for us is we could be experiencing all kinds of strange physical, mental, and emotional symptoms such as foggy-headedness, headaches, stress, anxiety, fear, doubt, worry, difficulty sleeping, insomnia, intense dreams at night, vertigo, strange pains, ringing in the ears, rapid mood swings, extreme fatigue, increased intuition or clairvoyance, nausea or flu-like symptoms, aka DNA upgrades, extreme hunger or lack of hunger. Don't worry, you're not crazy, you're not dying, you're just raising your consciousness at a rapid pace. So some suggestions is to meditate for at least five minutes a day, use a timer and just sit and notice your breath. This calms the body, mind and spirit. Grounding and earthing, put your bare feet on the ground. Communicate with your higher self and get downloads. It's a time for rest and relaxation. Drink plenty of spring water, no fluoride. Self-love practices and self-care, eat whole foods, go for long walks in nature, spiritual counseling with a trusted coach or guide. You can apply for a session with us in the description box below. If you dig this video, then please hit that subscribe button once again. We come out with videos every week on Ascension, energy updates, and twin flame relationships. Now for an intuitive message. This is the Lion's Gate. The veil is lifting. Our spirits are rising. We're becoming more of who we are and letting go of that which no longer serves us. The programming, the conditioning, the illusions, we're letting it go. It's time to let go of the delusions and call in truth. As we let go of the past, we step into the present, which gives us more choice for where we want to go and who we want to be in the coming golden age. This is a time to set your greatest intentions, to commit to your greater purpose and call in true love that's rooted in wholeness, the word which also means holiness. This is our time to shine big and bright, to release the shackles of fear, doubt, worry, and grief, to forgive and forget, 
to no longer go into agreement with limitations of thought or belief systems. This is the time to become a beacon of light. Be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Renew your mind during this time of great upheaval. Connect to your center, the infinite mind of the creator, and choose your highest destiny from this place. After all, it is your choice. You have that power, the divine right of free will. Take this time to do a ceremony for yourself, to step into manifestation, practice, meditate on your highest excitement for this next chapter for yourself, your loved ones, and for the greater world. Yes, you have the power to consciously create your future. Your consciousness pierces through the veil of collective consciousness. And the more of us who choose the best future for our individual selves and our individual earths, the better future we'll co-create. We're all co-creating parallel earths. And our consciousness is powerful. Make no mistake, we can create the changes we want to see with our consciousness and with our daily actions. Lead by example and the world will be changed forever. Much love. Namaste. Namaskar.